Conversation Corner, Thomas Amal, how are you? Meaning, how are you? This is another special edition, and what I wanted to briefly b discuss is awareness. How important awareness is. Awareness of all of your surroundings, in essence, uh, sensory ac acuity. It's awareness. Being able to see what is happening. You know, being able to recognize the different mood swings, being able to recognize the different gestures or, you know, the um, emotions that come with any individual or scenario, or whatever. Just being aware, learning, learning about yourself, opening up yourself, opening up and being more accepting and willing to see what is going on in this world and what is happening in your very surroundings. You only have control of yourself. You only have control of the actions that you take. But what you can do and, and, and to help you develop even more, and, and I have to stress again, personal development, personal growth is so imperative in our lives. And it doesn't stop. It's an ever-continuing uh, um, uh, issue. It's an ever-continuing education, personal growth. It does not stop. No one has reached the level um, where they uh, cannot learn anymore. You know, uh, I just, I'm a firm believer that we need to do a better job of helping ourselves individually, internally. Remember, if you want to make change, you have to change your way of thinking. It's actually thought that changes you. You can look at everything and everyone that is of something, of some substance. It's their mind that they're, that's leading them. And whatever you think about, however much emotions that you put into that thought, that's why that thought comes it turns into action and the results. It's what you put into it. It's the emotion you put into it. So if you are a Debbie Downer, if you miss negative, if you miss the negative, if you're Mr. Half Glass Full, that means you're putting that emotion into it and that's what you're thinking about and that's what's going to continue to come in your life. Make the changes that you necessarily need, that you so necessarily need. Step up to the plate. Remember, you control your very existence. You control your life. No one else does. No one else does. I hope no one is putting a gun up to your head to help make you do the things that you do. But right now, as we discuss, you have control. As long as you are living and breathing, you have control to make whatever changes that you see fit. And right now is the time. What I would suggest you do and what I would tell you to do right now is click the links below. I would tell you to get involved in what I'm involved in and see why we are so happy. See why we're gaining friendships in all walks of life. See why we're having a ball expressing ourselves. See why we are talking about traveling around the world. See why we are constantly talking about helping others and educating others to have them open their minds and their lives. We're not talking about religion. We're not talking about mind games. What we're doing is talking about refreshing you, pressing the restart button on your mind, washing all of the ignorance that we've been get, uh, uh, that has been deposited in our minds, and you add it into your everyday life, and those changes will start to develop growth. It's what you need. Personal growth. Conversation Corner. Thomas Amal. Talk to you soon. Peace.